here we are going to run the maven compile goal as the name suggests the compile goal compiles a source code the compile goal identifies the java class under src main java and compiles it and places the compiled classes under target classes folder goals in maven are packaged in plugins which are essentially a collection of one or more goals in the example that we just ran the compiler is the plugin that provides the goal compile the next example that we are going to run will introduce us to the clean goal maven follows a well defined build life cycle when it builds tests and distributes an artifact the life cycle constitutes a series of stages or steps that get executed in the same order independent of the artifact being produced maven refers to the steps in life cycle as phases maven has uh, the following three build life cycles the first one is called the default that we are looking right now this life cycle handles the compiling packaging and deployment of a maven project to better understand the build life cycle and its phases let's take a look at some of the phases associated with the default life cycle let's take the first one validate validate runs and checks to ensure the project is correct and that all the dependencies are downloaded and available do you remember whenever you run uh, maven clean install or maven clean it tries to download uh, some files for you that is what uh, the validate phase does for you the next one we are going to look at is compile that we already saw in uh, one of the demo where it compiles the source code and dumps it in target classes folder another important phase is called test the test phase runs all the unit tests using the whatever framework you have chosen junit mockito or something else this step doesn't require the application to be packaged then we are going to look at package package assembles a compiled code into a distributable format such as jar or war file if you notice in your pom.xml right in the second or third line where it says packaging we always define what type of package we want a particular code to be uh, you know zipped in it could be a jar file war file or it could be just a maven plugin another one is called install the install phase install the package archive into a local repository the archive is now available for use by any project running on that machine the last one and the most important one is called deploy deploy pushes the build archive into a remote repository for use by other teams and team members because the default life cycle clearly defines the ordering of phases you can generate an artifact simply by running the command maven package or mvn package maven will automatically execute all the phases prior to the requested phases in the provided example maven will run phases such as compile and test prior to running the package phase this means the developers and the configuration manager only have to learn and use a handful of commands